up, YouTube? It's your boy, JB, a.k.a. The King of Soul. And today we are taking a look at the Air Jordan 1 in the pine green colorway. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to the channel. If you do dig the content, do me a favor. Hit that share button below. Also, feel free to leave a comment. What I do on this channel is I do review and unbox both retail and UA sneakers. In no way, shape, or form doing these videos do we ever condone the sale or resale of any replica sneakers. We just do these videos just to simply highlight similarities and just to let you guys know at the end of the day, you got options. So without further ado, let's get into it. Here's your one pine green. So when you unbox the shoe, you're met with your standard tissue paper just like you would with any other Air Jordan 1. I'll get both of them. Put that to the side. And there you go. Air Jordan 1 Pine Green. Um, the shoe does come unlaced when you do receive it in the box, you know, but at the end of the day, like for the reviews, I do lace up my sneakers. I just feel like it's a better look. But overall, Air Jordan 1 Pine Green, I just feel like this was a, a, a dope colorway. Um, I, it is kind of consistent with the color blocking that you will find on most Jordan 1 sneakers, like the bread toe, the core purple, shattered backboards, uh, 1.0s, and the upcoming you know, Air Jordan 1 Taxi. Um, I just feel like with that color block in, they can't lose. Like, no matter what the color may be, I just feel like, you know, they'll win every time with this color, color blocking on the silhouette. Um, but the Air Jordan 1 Pine Green, in my opinion, I feel like it's one of the best Air Jordan 1s of all time. Um, I would even go further, in my opinion, and don't beat me up in the comments, but I would go even further and say that I feel like the Air Jordan 1 Pine Green is probably one of the top five Air Jordans of all time. Um, I just feel like it was a dope, you know, option. It was a good color. Because, you know, when we get, um, Air, whenever we get Air Jordan 1 releases, it's a situation where we always get that Chicago Bulls colorway. It's always that red, black, and, you know, white. But it was just something about the green when the shoe was released. I just feel like, you know, it was... It was something different, and overall, I just feel like it was just a, a dope, you know, option for the shoe. Um, this shoe was released September 22nd of 2018. Um, it was released alongside the Air Jordan 1 Court Purple. Um, of the two, I feel like the Air Jordan 1 Pine Green was the better of the two. Um, I just feel like overall, like I said, it was just a dope combo, but on the lateral side of the shoe, um, the overall build of the shoe is pretty much what you would, what you would expect from like any other Air Jordan 1, um, shoe. Um, the leather on it, the quality is pretty decent. Um, it's not what you would find like on the Air Jordan 1 shattered backboard. And I know everybody's probably tired of hearing about that. I still to this day don't understand how the Air Jordan 1 shattered backboard became like the gold standard for the Air Jordan 1 leather quality. Um, I feel like you can get that quality on shoes like the Court Purple, the Air Jordan 1 um, Obsidian. Um, there's a few of them. Like it's not where it was like that leather was just so amazing. I don't know, maybe when it just came out around the time and then the color that orange just made it pop. But um, overall, pretty dope shoe. On the lateral side, you got your Wings logo, green along the panels. Um, on the mid panel here, the leathers, you know, like I said, pretty decent. Um, but this is not a white. It's actually like more of a, a sail. Um, and from what you will find on the, the midsole here, it's, it's white here. This is sail. And I do kind of like how those two kind of like blend. Like, you know, it does like contrast along the shoe. I think it do add, you know, a little bit of character to the shoe and, you know, kind of make the colors pop a little bit more. Um, but that was the lateral side, so going on the medial side of the shoe, pretty much the same thing. Green along the panels, black Nike um, check, um, sell along the mid panel here. Um, there's your toe box on the inside of the shoe. I'm not really going to take out the insole, but it's, uh, it's, it's white and then it has like the, the green Nike here. But um, the shoe does come with two different laces. I know like some shoes came with just like that standard green, but mine and a few others, I know they came with that white sail color. Um, and the lace options on the shoe, I mean, of them all, I feel like I'm gonna just run with the black. I don't really see a need of swapping it out to the green or the sail at all. 
Um, but overall, again, I just feel like this was a pretty, you know, good thought out shoe. Um, Nike Air on the tag. There's the medial side. There's the bottom. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get the back because I know like a lot of y'all like to do it got that hourglass. Yes, it does have the hourglass. So there you go. But um, I'm going to go ahead and give y'all a B-roll, and then I'm going to also give you guys an on foot of this shoe. But there it is, Air Jordan 1 Pine Green. But um, again, these videos are strictly for educational purposes. So when we do these reviews, I mean, we're just we're just like, you know, like, you know, it's it's getting it's getting crazy out here as far as like the UA game like they they in there like they're making them the same if not better in my opinion like i just feel like the quality on this shoe is amazing probably i don't want to hurt nobody feelings or nothing but i feel like it might be a little bit better than what the retail is from what i've seen so i don't know man get it how you get it like i said we do this just to let you know that you got options out here but i'm gonna get up out of here we're gonna get y'all the b-roll and we're gonna get that on foot um, make sure you guys hit me on all of my social network channels. Um, I'm on Instagram, I'm on, I'm on Twitter, um, TikTok, everything is at the King of Soul, K-X-N-G-O-F-S-O-L-E on every platform. So make sure y'all stay engaged. If y'all have any questions, y'all want more game or if y'all want more pictures, I mean, anything, you know, if I miss something, let me know. Um, but overall, I would get a shoe a 10 out of 10, man. Like, I just feel like it's just an excellent shoe. But again, you know, hit me up in the comments. Let me know how y'all feel. Even if it's a situation, I know, like I told you earlier, like I feel like the shoe, you know, it came out with the, the core purples. If it's a situation, if you feel like the core purples might be a little bit better, I mean, leave me a comment too. Let me know. I'm open for conversation. But um, let's get up on out of here. There's your...